talk about what is on the line. So you're fighting the number four ranked fighter in the world. You go in there and you win. Where does that put you, Josh? I, I know what you want. Obviously, you want that title shot and you want that belt. Where does this leave you after you win this fight? Yeah, so after I get my hand raised on Saturday night, um, I, I can't overlook uh, Cater because he's such a dangerous uh, yeah. fighter that's standing in front of me. But yeah. with a huge win, a big finish, um, I'm next in line for the title fight. You know, uh, but but I have to go in there. I have to get the job done. I have to get my hand raised. Yeah. And uh, I, I've, I've been preparing so hard for this. And, and the, the most dominant version of myself will show up on Saturday night. And, and I'm willing to go through anything, whether it's, you know, <laughs> I, I don't know on paper, it could be the toughest fight of my life, yeah. but I don't know until I get in there. I want to, I want to get in there. I want him to throw at me. I want to see how fast he is. I want to feel how hard he hits. I want to tie up with him, see how strong he is. And then, uh, man, we'll, we'll see. I'll, I'll tell you after if it was the hardest <laughs> fight of my life or the easiest fight, but man, I, I'm so ready. And uh, it's going to show on the 18th. I, I'm not putting bad, uh, bad energy out with this question. Uh, you you know how we've just talked about how important this is to you being 37 do you view this as like hey this is probably my last best chance to get a title shot and and therefore uh it makes saturday a must win uh, do, do you view it like that or, or don't you look at it that way josh no not at all like uh you know uh i feel like with age i, I feel the best i've ever felt and wow. you know a lot of people talk about you know when you get older you lose speed i'm fast as hell like i i, I the power is still there the speed is there. Yeah. I have all the, the years of experience. I also haven't taken damage in any fights besides one fight in my entire yeah. amateur professional career. I'm usually the hammer. Yeah. And um, I have the, the best team behind me. Like literally, I have everything dialed in uh, with from dietitians to my acupuncturist, my, you know, my, my PT, my chiropractor, my yeah. orthopedic surgeon, everybody, my coaches, family, friends, um, everyone that has invested in me i've been saying this is our time it's not my time it's our time uh, because everyone that has invested in me their uh, return on investment is going to pay dividends on uh, saturday and uh yeah I i'm ready to go like i i literally feel say i don't look i don't look my age i don't fight my age and i sure as hell don't feel my age so uh i still feel like i'm uh you know i haven't even hit my prime but i'm coming yeah. into my own and with me getting in the sport later than most and not taking damage i think that's helped me tremendously Hey, and look at Glover, obviously know what happened on Saturday, but he was 30 seconds away from defending that title and he became exactly. champion at 42. So uh, you're, you're a young guy next to him, right? Right. He gives me hope. He gives yeah. Me hope. Yeah. 